United States v. Cooley, 2021. In 2016, Officer James Saylor of the Crow Police Department in Montana noticed a truck on the side of the highway and stopped to see if they needed assistance. Officer Saylor spoke with the driver, Joshua Cooley. Saylor noticed that Cooley appeared to have watery bloodshot eyes and appeared to be non-native. After noticing two semi-automatic rifles in the front seat, Officer Saylor ordered Cooley out of the truck because he feared there could be a violent confrontation. After a pat-down of Cooley, Saylor called for other officers for assistance. Saylor went back to the truck and noticed drug paraphernalia and methamphetamine in the front seat. When officers from the Federal Bureau of Indian Affairs arrived, Saylor was instructed to seize the contraband that was in plain view. Cooley was indicted on drug and gun offenses. Cooley argued that Saylor had no right to detain a non-Native American traveling on a public right-of-way road through a reservation. Saylor argued that he had the right to detain a non-Native American suspect and, in the course of doing so, found illegal drugs and guns in the vehicle. The case went all the way to the U.S. Supreme Court. In a unanimous decision, the Supreme Court ruled that tribal police have the authority to temporarily detain non-Native American persons traveling on public right-of-way roads running through a reservation. The court ruled that tribal police can reasonably detain temporarily and search non-Native Americans they suspect, quote, threatens or has some direct effect on the political integrity, the economic security, or the health and welfare of the tribe, unquote.